Hi everyone, we're up in Kielder today and you can see in the background there we've got Kielder Castle right behind us. Um, we're doing a nice little walk, about three and a half miles uh, at the top end of Kielder Forest and uh, around uh, over Kielder Viaduct. So come along with us, enjoy the walk and our witterings and ramblings. You see Tina's really enthusiastic and keen as usual, and she's been practicing her ventriloquism because you don't see her lips move very often. Oh, shut up. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, come along, folks, enjoy the walk, and we'll catch you later. So, Kielder Castle is, say, the starting point for our walk today. It uh, dates back to the 18th century and was originally built as a hunting lodge up in Kielder. Um, did you say hunting lodge then? Hunting lodge, yes. yes. Okay. A lodge where they stopped when they were hunting in the forest. And uh, nowadays it's the trailhead for all the mountain bike routes and there's loads of walks from here and so on. Those of you of a certain age will remember it from motorsport for the Kielder Forest and all the stages around here. I think that's the Zog Trail. Well, they're all different colours, oh. sweetheart. This was purple. Ish, yeah, but we're not actually following one of their trails. But there, are, there are numerous walking trails and so on, and so on here. <coughs> You'll see here there's to the Kiel de Viaduct, the Minotaur Maze, Sky Space, and the Duchess Trail. So loads of waymarked routes here. So we're and going plus down there's here. loads of others you can find as well. We'll be uploading this one to uh, our Kamut and Strava feeds, so if you want to download it. From there, feel free. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go off here and turn left through this gateway. No cycling, walking trail only, thank you. I thought you'd say no truck cycling and no walking. What's the point of the trail? But, uh, yeah. So, we do a loop, do we, and come yes, back this way? That's correct. It it's says we come circular. back the Lakeland Walk. Who did? Who said that? Oh, no, that's what it said on there. So we're not actually doing the one on there. See, Tina has a habit of reading other people's routes and assuming that we're following them. Ooh. A maze. Yes, I know. It's said on there. A maze. A maze. And you just read it. A I maze. Know, I just didn't realise it was... I wasn't paying enough attention to realise it was actually right where we were. The river's nice and high there, isn't it? Remember, we're following your route, yes, as I'm you good. said, and not theirs. I know. Nice view up to the castle, then. There must be salmon in there because there's a salmon centre. Uh huh. Yes, I do like walking this time of year with the uh, the autumn colours on the leaves. It really makes it uh, nice. It's got that crisp autumn sort of smell. To the air, hasn't it, as well? Well, we're on the Zog Trail, look. There's oh, a bunny. Come on, you're, you're the Zog expert. What is it? <laughs> is it a hare? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't got that far yet. OK, anybody in the comments? You're experts on Zog. Who is this? This way. Oh no, it's not, not Zog. That is Zog Trail. It is, I yeah. thought it was Alice in Wonderland for a minute with the Alice with the crown on. It's a mouse. This is a mouse. It's a mouse. Ickle mouse. Ickle mouse. I had to take pictures of these, grand uh, Nigel, so we can show yeah. Cooper. I'm not your granddad. Don't keep I calling know, me I'm granddad. I know, I'm granddad. Nigel, <laughs> to show Cooper. And Jack and Stanley and Griffin, of course. Oh, a bit of an afterthought, they Well, were, they all they? do. Well, they all do the gruffalo, don't they? At, in, at home. Uh huh. Geez, that is high. Uh, no, not that high. <laughs> it's, it's, it's flowing well, but I mean, you could have another couple of foot before you consider it high. I think. Bye bye Zog Trail, we're not going your way, we're going straight. Right on. We're going. <coughs> hey. 
Well, my, although that said, I think they both kind of go straight on, don't they? Which way are we going? We're going that way. Right, okay. So. Yeah, because it's literally... Yeah. Whoa! Watch. <laughs> Where are we going, dear? We could have done the Zog Trail and got some stickers at the end of it. <laughs> Weird, because you come... Yeah, well, I think that trail sort of goes up, up, up over that way. It sort of moves away Are you from following the... us? Because this I is how yeah. green... Yeah, we follow the river, dear. And all up until we get to a bridge and then we're going to cross over it. And then come back? Well, sort of, yeah. but moving away from the river up into the forest. Oh, that's quite a... Uh... Well, that team. What? Certainly flowing well there, isn't it? I know. Quite dirty, isn't it? Oh, it's just stirs up yeah, all the... Yeah, all uh... the muck. All the moth, doesn't it, because the flow. It's normally nice clean white water. Yeah. But at the moment it's yucky water. It is indeed. One like to think we'd have got across that. Oh, it'll be no Nigel, let's turn around and go back. Yes, I wouldn't fancy the river crossing on that. This. Oh no! What? Our, river, our bridge is closed. Alright, so we can't go. Stop, do not go further. Please note that the Duchess Trail is closed from the 30th, that's today. Yeah, so it's closed. No! Oh, what a bummer! Right, let's turn around. You know that river crossing you didn't want to do? Piss off. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, I know the track goes down there, but no. No. That's a real no. bummer, though. You can walk. Man, it's pointless walking well, to so the bridge. Do not go walk. further. Yeah, and you've got to follow instructions. So, okay, so. Shall we do the Thogger Trail instead then? Well, I think this means we're, we're what they call off piste now. We're not going on the planned route. We're going on somewhere totally different. So we'll head back down here and back in, uh, towards Kielder, uh, Kielder village, and then go over the viaduct the way we would have come back, I think. Like we came from up there, didn't we? We did. We're going to go, We're going to go straight down, down there. Yes. Yep, we've got everything here, look. Lonesome Pine, Bloody Bush Trail, Lakeside Way, Cross Border Trail, Osprey MTB Diversion. So you've got about everything you like down this path. I've got a feeling it's where we would have come back. It's exactly where we would have come back. So I'm just... Yeah. You remember what I said we turn around and we'll go back the opposite way? Yeah, we'll get to the viaduct then and then. Let's play it by ear, make it as we go along. So is the viaduct like a dam? No, no, it's a viaduct. So what does it actually do? It crosses, spans a gorge. For the railway to go across. So, for example, if you wanted to, it's like a big bridge, uh -huh. basically. A viaduct is. And this one's quite special because the arches on it aren't straight, they're at an angle. So, whoever built it was pissed. No, it was designed <laughs> that way. It's the first one of its kind. I'm taking the Mickey Eye job. <laughs> As if they would have done it because they were pissed, you tit. Oh, dear me. Oh, 
never quite know with you whether you're being serious or not. <laughs> yes, yeah, so this is say it's part of the lakeside way. That if you ride this, basically it'll take you all the way down to Leapish, and then from there on carry on down right to the bottom of the lake to where the cafes and that are, and you follow it all the way around the lake if you want to. So it's the Lakeland ride. The lake which, side ride. Yes, which yeah. is the one we looked at before. Yeah. Hard to laugh at that sign. Be careful, rush rough trail. So that must be the rough bit they're on about. Yeah. If you're in a wheelchair, it's a problem. Well, yes. Right. That's where we go to the viaduct when we come back. Right. And as you can see, look, that's the old railway line. So where are we going now then? Up there. How far is it, Nigel? I couldn't tell you the top of my head, not far. Look. Baked in wildlife hide, that's where we're going. Uh, didn't say that. I mean, where are we going, dear? To these wood carvings, so this nice bench. That was, so, an art installation. What? An art installation, I think you'd call it. I want some wood carvings. Somebody's selling them, or are they just no. in the middle of nowhere? It's a bench that's been carved by an artist. All oh, right. It's not at all cold, is it? No, yeah, well, you keep a reasonably warm walk in. It's uh, shame about not... the rain, though. Yeah. Oh, hey, hey. I love it all, as they say. It is what it is. That's it. It is what it is. It rains. It rains. So what's it meant to be a carving art night? Oh, you'll see when you get there. Various animals, I think. I see. think that's a weasel or a ferret or something, or a stoat. You see this one, look? Uh-huh. Wow, come and have a look at this bird at the back. That's, that's an eagle, I think. Yeah, look at it. I'd wow. say there's otters on there. Mm. Maybe beavers? I'm no, they're that. not beavers. They haven't got the tail the beavers got. No. Look at that. Beautiful, isn't it? That the is... guy who did this, I can't remember his name off the top of my head, I will put it in the um, in the notes on the screen. But he was a self-taught sort of wood carver, an artist. No no formal training. And obviously um, that eagle's got a salmon out the lake. Yes, I think that's the... Uh... Wow. Yeah. Oh, of course, and the seat, the seat itself is like supposed to be the uh, the lake, isn't it? The water. Yeah, yeah, and there's another fish, look. Oh, yeah, another... In the lake, in the actual lake, yeah. look. And oh. so they are going to be... Um, what otters. did you do? Otters around the lake. It's all wood. Ooh, it's big yeah, it was a log windy. originally. Yeah. Yeah, a log, most probably out the, the forest and... Nice. On a nice summer's day, that would be nice to have a rest. It would. I ain't sitting on that because I'd be sitting as I'm in the lake because it's wet. <laughs> you would indeed, dear. So when we get to that finger post then, we go towards the viaduct. Yeah, and over the viaduct. If we got to the end of the inner, we pass that bloke with the dogs. Yeah. And turn right, we go down under the viaduct. But well, we want to go across it, don't we? Yes, and then turn around and come back. Well, loop round to the left. I think we'll probably take the shorter route. Yes. But we'll loop round and cut the other side back to that bridge we should have. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, we're going no, nowhere near there, are no. we? Oh, we come back out by that post. The road bridge. The road bridge. Yeah. And then figure out going back up the way we came because I don't fancy walking up the road all by, by that pub. Uh, it's the, the shortest route, in fairness. Is it? Well, yeah. we'll go that way then. Whatever's better because. <laughs> This weather's a bit... Damp. Yes. Oh, 
Moist? A bit wet. A bit moist. It's not cold, just wet, wet. and... Ooh. Shame the coffee van shut on Kielda. Pardon? A shame the coffee van is shut Yes, on I was just going to say that would have been ideal for a, a drink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, hey ho, it is the time of year, I suppose they don't think they get many Yeah, I thought they might have run to the end of the month, though, but it'd be half term. Gosh, there was no cars here when we came up here. There was a few, I think. Yeah, we can go. Where are right, we? We're here. Yeah. And we're going to go round to there. Round there. Yeah. yeah. But if we go that way round, we go under the viaduct, right? Right. Up that little bit we walked uphill before, and then go across the viaduct. So you can either go back that way and along, along, or go that way and we go under the viaduct. So you get to see it's going under it, and then walk across it. So. So again, we're there. So we're, we're gonna, there. So yeah. we can either go that way up there, the back way we came, uh -huh. and then just go straight across the viaduct to point five. Yeah. Or we can turn right here and go and go along that green line look and under the oh. viaduct, follow that path back to that junction where that shelter thing was. Yeah. Where you said you could park and turn round. Uh huh. Then go up to that point and then go over the viaduct. So we're going to the viaduct twice. No, we've got the option of going under it, then over it, or just going back and going over it. Obviously, going under it, you'll see it better. I'm just thinking you probably get a better look at the actual viaduct going under it rather than over it. But do you have to go over it? No, it depends where you want it, which way yeah. you want You don't have to get out the car, do you? Because I was saying we could take a picture of us under it and then come out of it and take a picture of over it. Because you don't have to be standing on it, do you? See what I'm saying? Not really, no. <sighs> Here we go, look, you see it nicely now. Wow, that's it. That's the viaduct, yes. Jesus, it's huge. Yeah. So we're going under it now. Going under it, yeah. And then this is the path out this year. When you go the other way, if you loop round, you walk over the top of it. So how do we get up it? Follow this loop round. You see what I mean about the arches look and the shape of them? Yeah, they're like... They're not straight, they're... Then drop. Yeah, it's, it's at an angle. But an arch isn't straight. Yeah, and it's like that because it's not built... At 90 degrees to the Like that. River. It's yeah. like that. It's, it's on an a slant anyway, yeah. yeah. So that's the point, yeah. That's the whole point. It's built at an angle. Oh. <laughs> What's my... No, we can't get. Okay. Is that a way... Is that a... Oh, jeez. Little. Ah, that's what that man was saying. If you go that way, you can get this way, you can't. Uh -huh. That's obviously... I'm not scrambling over a tree. <laughs> no. Okay, I'll just have a... I know, you see. see if it's... <sighs> that's a blow, isn't it? Yeah, so we've got to do it anyway. We can't do it, can't go around that route anyway. Not much luck with trees. Right, take a got... picture. That's not a bad idea, is it? <laughs> So that's what that man was probably telling her on a bike. You can't get round it. You can't get round it. Uh -huh. Oh. Come and have a look. It's no worse than what we did over the... You know when we got Cooper Vicky and them? Oh, yeah. Well, you'd have to go through there, then you're through it. We're going to have a look. Here we go. Here we go with exploring, folks. It's a bit boggy, Nigel. No way I can get my legs over it. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't got my leg over for a long time. <laughs> I mean... Yeah, you get down cushy cushy your hey? trekking poles, dear. Yeah, just keep an eye on me.
Am I down long you enough? Did, yeah, go on. Am I? Nearly. Just down, you that bit behind a touch. That's it, you're through. Yeah, I'm out. You're out. Okay. Can I'm you do it? Yeah, I'm coming. I'm, I'm just going to get my dodgy leg over. <laughs> There you go, we're through folks. But just enlighten me, when we walked over it, we haven't got to come back down here. There you go folks, that's what we've got under. So that wasn't a long loop to go under it, but it's worth it because you see the arches better there. I'm waiting to see how, the, how we're going to get on the top of it because that's quite high. It's very easily. Steps. No. You know that hill we walked up? Uh -huh. That's how you get on top of it. They turn left. So we've got to go back up that hill? That little hill, yeah. <laughs> How did you get through there? How oh, we just lifted it out the way. <laughs> Climbed through it. <laughs> got the chainsaw out the back and carved it up. The lovely bench bed that we made of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, that wasn't that bad, was it? No. Parked there now. That's a different car. How oh, is it? Yeah. So we don't come this way. We go no. over it and down the other side. Yes. Which is the way we should have come in. Yeah. Yeah. Because we'd have come back this way. And. But we're going to miss that bridge yeah. out somehow. If we'd have come the way we originally planned, we'd have come down here, gone left, gone up to that then bench, come back come and back, gone down there, down there and left. But we haven't got to come back this no. way. It's got a distinct look of an old railway, hasn't it? The yes. sort of dead flat art, the, the trees. So this is the old ra the, the railway? Yeah. That's what the viaduct was for. God, you're quite high up, really. Yes, that's a nice thing. You and yet that wasn't very steep no, to get up. No, we covered quite a distance. Yeah, because it was like that, so, wasn't yeah, it? It was a gentle climb. Which is what I don't mind. It's yeah. when you look at it and go, now we've got to get up there. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> That's it. So we're about to walk over it? Yeah. It looks bigger down there. <laughs> Shall I tell them they can't get under? See, now, if they can't see it from there, they've got a problem. Oh, yeah, because it is there, isn't it? <laughs> that life jacket was just after we'd gone under it. But we came the other side. Well, we came from that way, under there. Yeah. So you might see it from here in a minute. Let's have a look. Down. There yeah. you go. Hi, guys. <laughs> we got round this way and got past. Oh, yeah. yeah, but we came from that direction. But we came, if you see the tree stump here, you can get under it. You can get under it. It just means you've got to get down and then get under it, then you're out and you just come round. We came from there, that, that direction and came under here. Amazing. Don't come back alive, your fault. We did it, honestly, because we thought we were debated. Then I came round and said to my husband, we can get under that. Okay, yeah. Okay. Amazing. Thank you. There you go, see? <laughs> <laughs> There's always a way. <laughs> <laughs> you just have to remember you've got a bag on your back. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy your day. <laughs> Bye. Thank you, Lisa. See? Yeah. And now you see why the benefit of coming up here. Look at that. I know, beautiful, isn't it? There you go, folks. This is the views from top of Keel the Viaduct. As they say in the bear hunt, we can't go under it. We can't go. I mean, we have been under it. We, we, under we have been under it. We have been under it. We have been under it and climbed under a tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that one. 
overhead electrical power lines do not take current wreck long objects past them. Yeah. Bloody hell, it's going to be a really long... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> but... Oh, here you go. Oh, here's another nice picture of it, look. Oh, wow, you'll have to take one. Come on to the... Ah, we go watch you dropping down. So here you go, take one couple Well, we're going here. down and round, aren't yeah. we? This is what I remember riding past here and seeing wow. this and going, that looks amazing. They don't look uneven this side either, look. Well, they do. They well, look, no, they yeah. look more like an arch than what they do from the other side. There you go, folks. Good. That's a, a good a view of Keel handle. the Castle. Okay, it's online. That's a good view of Keel the Viaduct. The Bridge. <laughs> it's, uh, that we've just been under, been over, and now walking... Past it. Past it. So, I think you can reasonably say we've done all the options haven't we yeah you can see where it slopes look going in look it's like that yeah isn't it it's not through it's like yes. that the walls yeah it's because the, the see, as we said earlier the, the bridge doesn't cross no um Why do they put all them in then? Well, what's going to happen if they don't? Flood. No. So if the water's coming out of that pipe and dropping straight down, what's it going to do? Splash everywhere. No. Well, it will, but that's not a point. Fill the hole up. No. It's going to make a deeper hole and wash away the Oh, stuff. yeah. So by hitting the stones, it breaks it up into a more even flow. So it trickles down better and doesn't erode the... Oh yeah, because it go that, because it does that, doesn't it? And yeah. you get it all out. Yeah, so it helps erosion. Great if you saw salmon jumping out, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah. And then you see a great big grizzly on the other side. That's people on the other side. That's them. Uh -huh. There you go folks, we're just getting uh, the last leg of the walk now back towards Keel the castle where it starts getting a bit busier so we'll wrap up with it here. Did you enjoy that dear? Yes it was great actually, yeah. Yeah not, not the walk we planned. No. Nope. But uh, nice one just Interesting. Just Interesting yeah, some nice wood carvings, good look at the viaduct, bit of scrambling through the uh, undergrowth. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, yeah thanks for watching folks, don't forget to uh, hit the like button and consider subscribing, it all helps the channel. And uh, see you soon. See you soon. We're off to uh, find a cafe and a nice piece of cake and a cup oh, of coffee. I love a piece of cake. <laughs> see you later, folks. Bye, Bye. now. Bye. Oh, is that the shortcut way? What's the maze? All oh, right. So, which way are we going to go up? Up well, past the Ancla? Yeah. Yeah, may as well. Yeah. Because if we go that way, we're going to go up the other side of the maze, aren't we? Yeah, up them steps. Do you think this is more steep though? Uh, don't know. Do you want to go this way? I'll keep out the way of the cars if nothing yeah. else. Because there's a wall I can hold on to going up there, can't I? I mean, that's oh. quite steep to be honest. Aye. Because that takes us up near the castle anyway. Yeah, it takes you to the front of the castle, and that's yeah. the other side of the castle. Yeah. yeah I mean, you. look. Yeah, well, if you look see that wooden rail is, look. Yeah. That's where I was going to turn off and go up anyway. Up them steps? Yeah. Oh, come on then. Well, you've gone this way now. Don't matter, come on. <laughs> You're so indecisive. <laughs> Let's explore.